So, just a wee intro to this video, it was actually recorded nearly a year ago, and, well, life happened, um, I forgot I'd even made the video, um, and I've just found it while getting ready for a new series that I will be putting out next week, so, just thought I'd put this one out, it's part of the old Adults Craft series, I do plan on making a video shortly of a wrap up of because I have been building on it, I've just not had time for the videos. So, yeah, enjoy the video. Hello everybody, and welcome back to another video from the Adults Craft server. Today we're going to be working on storage. I have attempted to be all organised with all this stuff, but yeah, there's just random stuff everywhere i already starting to lose track of things and i haven't even built the majority of the farms that I want yeah this guy randomly he, he escaped so now he just goes between being a butcher and being an armor because i haven't traded with him but anyway um you probably saw it the last time even out here's becoming a mess with all this stuff um, you probably saw at the end of the, or the middle of the last episode, we had started on building up some of the storage and stuff like that. Um, that was the bulk storage for all these blocks and stuff. So, we'll get that done. Um, what I'm also going to put in is a multi-item sort of kind of thing. Very similar to what we used in Season 1 over on Bedrock. Um, obviously it's just modified a bit, it is actually the, I think it was Tango Tech that put it out, oh, I'll be having that, uh, it's his design, it is a few, probably a few years old now, but it still seems to be working, so we're going to get that built up as well, and I think we'll probably just jump into a time lapse of me building that, hopefully, unless something has gone majorly wrong, as I just do the gardening over here so yeah we'll see you once i've done that oh. So, as you saw before, we have the multi-item sorters. I ended up building two modules so far. I can expand it that way if I need to. We've also got the block storage, the bulk items. So we've got all the stone types, or all the big block types, I would say. Then we have wood and planks. I think I've got them the other way around now. I think the wood's up there and the plank's down here. But anyway... Um, they're all hooked up to the shulker unloader. Um, I found this design on Google. If I can find it again, I will stick it in the links down below so you can see who it was. I can't remember offhand. Um, and up there, it's just your standard impulse item filters that run all of these. These are just the same items, so it's like stone, and I think there's about 10 chests worth. Um, what we will have is a second floor there, do some kind of 
designed to hold it up. Um, yeah, that pretty much all done. What we need to now do with these is basically go through and choose what we're putting in them all. Um, and then basically block out the rest so that they're not the same as we did in the one we had in season one basically. I also need to hook up down here there should be a hopper output somewhere for the overflow. I'm sure it'll be down there somewhere. I need to find that and hook it up to a chest just in case there's anything that I don't put in these. So I think, I think we'll go and so there it's there. Can I get out? So I think I'll probably go and pack all the stuff up and then we'll move it in here and see how we can organise stuff and do a bit of decorating while we're at it. So we'll see once we've got all that done ish. Probably won't finish it. So as you can see I've now put started putting a wall in and I've got the doorway which mirrors the one that we've got for the iron farm cave area. Um, you'll also notice I've changed shader packs. I'm thinking I like this one better and it seems to look a bit nicer. I'm quite enjoying the fact the ores glow in the walls because it shows it off a bit better. Um, but anyway, uh, we have... going to have a window or something up there at some point. But if we walk in, there's a bit of decoration has gone into it. So you can see the bulk storage is over here. We've got the sort of carried the wooden beam theme over, but we've sort of decorated it up, make it look fancier and a bit more permanent structure. You've got the copper sort of holding everything together kind of thing. Um, the shulker loader is hiding in behind here now, so you can put stuff in there. Empty shulkers are in this barrel down here. And it all feeds into the system. Uh, got a wee stairway up to the top level so we can grab our logs and stuff like that as well. Or maybe decorate this up a wee bit more in the future. I don't think I need that anymore. So yeah, looking fancy. I'm not sure whether to decorate up in there but we'll, we'll see. It will evolve as we go. Then we've got the sort of multi-item storage is all over here now and I have, if, it, if I can reach, I've got it sorted out. So I've got the bamboo renamed as padding just to fill in the gaps and then we've got what we've got. Um, so stuff just split up as we go. Obviously this will evolve over time, get filled up, new things will get added to it. Got shiny ones over here food and stuff like that We've got some some crafting things that we use here um, instead of having just the little chest I've put in these are just hooked up they're not part of the multi item sorter they're just a load of random chests so that anything that's not filtered out by these two systems will end up here so they'll be loading on stackables and stuff like that and random heads and things just gives them somewhere to go so that they're not just disappearing into the back. Um, and then just now, I haven't... If I need to put another one of them in, I can put one here. But just now I've just got a wee sort of mini smelter set up. My bed and, you know, some bits and pieces just that you use regularly. Um, throwing a bit more copper into the roof just to fancy it up a wee bit. So yeah, I think that for now, obviously there is some more decoration on that wall and I don't like that wall or this bit here, but you know what, there's still loads to be done to it and it's going to, over time, evolve up. So yeah, I think we'll call it a day there. That's a lot of work that's been put in um, and I need to start planning out farms and things that I want to build. So, yeah, as always, any suggestions, especially for decorations for like the walls and stuff like that, let me know down in the comments below. 
If you've enjoyed the video, hit that thumbs up button, and if you haven't already, please do consider subscribing. It really helps me out, it lets me know you're enjoying the content and all that kind of stuff. So, that is going to do us for today. Yeah, we will see you later. Goodbye.